If you like what you see, why don't you think about subscribing? And make sure to check out my channel for videos just like this.
Because everybody likes music. Okay, almost everybody. I know what the problem is. We have a room full of people from different places. And you all have your own idea of what good music is. My job, find out what it's going to take. So I ask, how many people out there like jazz music? Well, the people that like rhythm and blues. Do I have anybody who likes rock and roll music? rock and roll music. Yeah. Okay, a little bit of a qualifier.
somebody say all right? All right. Sing a couple of Barry Manilow songs and go home. But it's not to be. I got wild people. I got crazy people. I got insane people. I got you, baby. <laughs> I was shocked, I was amazed, I was stunned. Because to be totally honest with you, I am much too young to know any of the songs I just sang. <laughs> they belong to my older sister. I was brought up when music was about one topic, falling in love. How many people are you love tonight? Okay, what was that, eight years and a maybe? I got married people, look at each other. You in love, dear? No, not really, no, no. And I know what the problem is. You don't have love songs or love song singers today. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I see some young folks looking at me like I've lost my mind. Young folks, don't think I don't know your music. Anybody in the room under 21, say yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's all alone. Yeah. I don't want you to think I don't know your music and I wouldn't do your music. I know your songs. I drove my car into the bridge. I pushed my mother in the bridge. I don't care. I knew you would. See, you want to be quiet. Hi, I know you out there, young people. And I'm not going to leave you out. I don't care what it takes. We will find something for the young folk. We got one? Yeah, we got one. Try this. One, two, three. Here we go. Because you didn't pay for the cruise, that's why. <laughs> Mom and Dad paid for the cruise. Grandma and Grandpa, they pay for children they don't even know. <laughs> and teenagers, teenagers, do you want the truth? They didn't even really want to bring you. <laughs> they were just too scared to leave you home alone. So if anybody's getting any music tonight, it's going to be mom and dad.
my vantage point what I said? <laughs> it was a sea of arms waving in unison. It was, it was a perfect kumbaya moment. <laughs> and as beautiful as the moment was, I have to admit, I find myself somewhat concerned now. I'm extremely concerned. Thank you for asking. <laughs> I'm concerned because I don't want you folks to think that my program is only about jumping on piano and being frivolous. No. I say again, no. This, ladies and gentlemen, is an intellectual endeavor. They obviously don't believe me. So I shall simply prove my point by saying, ladies and gentlemen, at this particular juxtaposition of moments, I feel an overwhelming compulsion to elevate the quality of this evening's performance, ergo making it more edifying and educational. <laughs> oh, you didn't think I could talk that, did you? <laughs> and so I do believe it would behoove me greatly. Yes, I said, behoove me greatly. <laughs> to perform for you at this juncture, classic music done classically. <laughs> and so, ladies and gentlemen, I implore you, nay, I beseech you, prepare yourselves. <laughs> I say again, ladies and gentlemen, prepare yourselves for classic music done. Oh, no. 
round of applause. I love making music. I come from a musical family, as cliche as it may sound. My mother was a singer and an actress in the Baltimore, Maryland area where I grew up. I got Maryland people? Well, I guess I got Maryland people. You know what that means. I got to ride home. <laughs> Big Jim's Bar Grill Cafe. <laughs> To the degree, and I sure do like to party and stay up late. Yeah. I wanted to have fun, so I joined. Yeah. Got lucky by the time we were in our twenties, we were in Europe performing. And while we were there, I had the privilege of working with some very talented people. When I was a kid in Europe, very young performer, we had the honor of performing with Mr. Johnny Cash in the June Carter Cash Fair. Wow. We had the privilege of performing with a gentleman only a few people will know, but still in Europe, they talk about him because they miss him. His name was Mr. Victor Borga, and he was one of the greatest musicians you ever wanted to see. But it was in Stockholm, Sweden, when I was still a kid, that I met the man who would change my entire life. His name was Mr. Sammy Davis Jr. Whoa! And after watching him in a nightclub for seven nights, I quit the band I'd been in since I was 16 years old. Five years later, I found myself in Las Vegas, Nevada as the opening act for Mr. Don Rickles. <laughs> <laughs> but I was pleased as punch to be there. And on that night, I got a knock on my door. And when I opened that door, there stood Mr. Sammy Davis Jr. coming to wish me well. And from that day until the day he passed away, I was the luckiest man in the world because I got to call my hero my friend. And tonight we're going to take you back to Las Vegas in that era when Frank and Dean and Sammy and all the fellas reign supreme. Give me a good chord. Y'all no more showing off. They got to keep the gig. I wired and died on Mother Goose Hill. I have never wished for turkey. Man, I've hitched at a height and drifted through from me to Albuquerque. And when I go to London town, you know, I try to be so cool. I'm sorry to say that I never met the late great Peter O'Toole. Social circles spin too fast for me. One quick question. Does anybody remember Vegas back then? Yeah. Hopefully you'll remember this. Hopefully that's where I will be. Thank you. 
like that kind of music. Shoot. You know, but we were, yeah, we got to go. Oh, we ain't going nowhere. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry. I'm changing the show. I'm sorry, guys. I, I apologize, but I can't leave without doing this. Because of all the songs that I have ever heard and all the people I've ever seen before, this song and this guy are forever in my heart.
country. Okay, I just need to know who looked up here, saw me, and said country. Like that? You 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 want me to? Where are you from? Orlando, the home of country music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got, come on, man, you can do this, you're a professional, come on. Not unless you want to be on the unemployment line of all Hey, let's try this, bass and drums, just give me this, just get some country thing, just do this.
time. Do I have party people? We shall find out. One, two, three, let's go. Thanks for watching the video. 
If you like what you saw, please check out my channel for more videos just like this. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Until then, I'll see you next time. Peace.